Let me do this. Tom Keeper, give me 20 seconds for this question. Uh, we live in the greatest civil rights city in America. Lately, there seems to be a re-embrace of white bigotry, white nationalism, and white supremacy, protected by the President of the United States. What are your thoughts about Trump? I abhor any racism, any bigotry, any violence, any supremacy of, of any type. So I am absolutely opposed to any policies that reinforce that 100%. Hold on, wait a minute. But Ms. Norwood, what do you think about Trump, President Trump? We have a president. I am telling you that I do not support those policies. I am, I am saying to this audience that I do not support any policies that are bigotry, that are racism, that are in any way related to. Hold on, audience, please calm down. Thank you. Audience, we're not, no, we're not doing that. Calm down. Thank you. Ms. Norwood, will you finish with, with your response? I am finished. Okay. Tom, Ms. Norwood, since he did mention your name, would you like to respond? Mr. Ritchie, we have a president. I may not like the president. I may not support the policies that are in this country uh, and that are being promoted, but we have a president. This is what happens in this country. That election stands. If people wish to impeach the president, they wish to impeach the president. But I, as the next mayor, will be committed to getting the most I can get for Atlanta Tom. in financial resources Tom. in from every single part of the government Tom. in this in this country. Thank you, ma'am. Donald Trump is an enigma. He's narcissistic and he's divisive. The best thing that we can do right now is to elect a mayor who is the antithesis of Donald Trump, a person who is inclusive, a person who is transparent and is generally has the people's heart uh, that they hold dear. Tom, thank you. Ms. Bottoms.